Well, folks, it's time to kick it old school. Uh, so you can feel cool. <laughs> Hello, everybody, and... Oh, oops. Uh, welcome to Mackie's Toys. Now, today, I'm going to be using this. Now, if you don't know what this is... And now you should know what this is. And... It was quite weird. It kept bubbling and giving off a weird gas and I wasn't sure what it was. So, will soaking Orbeez in baking soda work as an activator for the crazy art? Oopsie, hold on. Got a beep beep. Crazy art clear slime glue. <laughs> okay, let's find out. Got a little bit. I'm gonna go crazy because I know how Orbeez works and the slime it doesn't really work. Um, should I color it? Um, hmm, hmm. Red? No reason really to color it. I mean, I don't even know if it's gonna work. That seems like enough. Okay, so this is basically the activator with Orbeez in it. So let's see if maybe the Orbeez to change it up a little bit so we'll add a little bit of the liquid and then we'll add a couple not a whole lot into the cup and stir it around stir it stir it stir it and there's definitely slime forming Oh wow, this is super sticky. So I'm gonna have to add a little bit more of the activator if I can get it off my hands. Or hand. Now it's hands. Mm. So I'm just gonna use the liquid from here as, as activator once again. So does adding, or not does adding, I mean, oh, it's just so ugly looking on the camera. Does adding baking soda and water to Orbeez make a difference? Um, Weirdly, it does, because although there's not a whole bunch of them in here, oops, oh, point proven, but like because there's not a whole bunch of them in here, I'll see if I can just, no, I can't. But with the regular Orbeez, or the ones in the glue, they kind of just, I don't know, fell out of the slime real easy. I mean, while granted, yeah, this will probably, you know, come out real easy. They're not falling and bouncing all over the table and etc etc but yeah this is cool so try it if you want who knows 